get out of virtual as soon as humanly possible. Yeah. Uh, I know facilitators who are going outside and doing workshops. It, if you could, we're so, we are, our PowerPoint is just, such a security blanket, but if you, you could be COVID safe and go outdoors if you're in a climate that's warm enough. And I think that'll be really fun and exciting for people. I know other facilitators will even go for a walk if it's a small group of two or three people and make it a discussion. But for me, the way that I, I build my environment, I remember my first public speaking contest, the, the judges said, don't be afraid to rearrange the furniture. So, you know, I, I don't know why some people, I guess I used to feel uncomfortable doing that. You know, walk in and build a space that feels really comfortable for people. Put them in teams, put them in groups, because some people are going to be more comfortable speaking out loud. Others are going to be in a small group. I personally don't like walking into a room that has a giant circle with 50 people staring at each other. <laughs> Me, anxiety. Yeah. I, there's a safety of being part of a team that when you're speaking, you're almost speaking for the team with the support of your team. So even if you say something silly, it's not just you. It's, you know, your team's got your back. Right. I'm, I'm big into clusters. And then you can make competitions and do all kinds of fun things when you've got small groups. 